You done fucked up, right? You know you did. <laughs> you know you done fucked up. <laughs> Cyclonus is coming. Oh, yes, he is. <laughs> you know you should have never did this. <laughs> this was a big mistake on your part. <laughs> what were you thinking, you idiot? Cyclonus is one of the realest Xbox dudes on YouTube. <laughs> and you, my friend, <laughs> you have enough balls and enough courage to mention his name? Ooh, you gonna get it! <laughs> you are gonna get it, Silver Sky Pony! <laughs> A.K.A. David Maddox! <laughs> I know who you are, David! Your feelings must be hurt! <laughs> but nothing can save you now, little Davey! So get your salty pony tears ready now. <laughs> you done fucked up. Oh yes you did, Dave. And Cyclonus is coming for you. <laughs> First off, I would like to say thank you for joining me. Now, I normally don't do this, but it had to be done. This time, I want to address a certain individual. Silver Sky Pony, AKA David Maddox. Which you should all know is a pony, and a delusional pony, I must add. A pony I destroy in a Google community. Well, the glitch community on Google Plus. I actually destroyed this dude so bad. Now hear this. He was actually hurt so bad. <laughs> he made a 25 minute video addressing me, which was a bore and very bland. No wonder why the PlayStation community doesn't support this guy. I asked him numerous questions about the things Xbox One can do and the PlayStation 4 can't. Well, there were a lot of questions I asked him and his replies to my questions were lackluster and his replies made no sense now you know you really had your feelings hurt when you go viral now this is the same idiot who goes around challenging people to debates mostly xbox dudes just to look stupid and lose to them no one respects him in the playstation community but this is the brand he chooses to represent I must admit that being in the PlayStation community must be tough because there's really nothing to talk about. That's why they spend most of their time bashing Xbox. And in the video, you can see him dodging my questions and having absolutely no answer for most of them. Now, these questions were almost impossible for a pony like David to answer. But just like a true delusional brainwashed idiot pony he makes himself look very dumb which is what happens when they're faced with the truth that the xbox one is the best 
What drove this man to make a video about me or the questions I asked him? Maybe he's insecure about the PlayStation 4 or maybe those questions cut him real deep and affected him emotionally. Who knows? <laughs> Are you hurting David? <laughs> Are you hurting? <laughs> but David Maddox is not your average pony. He is a very sick pony who sleeps with stuffed pony toys and plays with them. Hell, he probably feeds them too. <laughs> Folks, I'm serious and I'm not making this up. Check this out. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This dude is retarded and crazy. He probably fucks himself in the ass with a DualShock 3 controller. And he would probably suck Yoshida off. Another crazy thing about this guy is that he proudly calls himself a pony. But at least he's honest. So David, you shouldn't mind me calling you that. While it seems pretty obvious to me that Sony fanboys and delusional ponies are making the PlayStation 4 out to be God's gift to gamers. It's pretty silly. Especially considering it's weak library and lackluster functionality. Really? While the PlayStation 4 is not the best current gen console in terms of hardware, design that is, it's just a power upgrade. Nothing worth getting that excited about at this point. Today I have a bone to pick with Sony fanboys like Silver Sky Pony and Fiends spawn from the good hearted PlayStation 4 fans out there and it saddens me. Obviously I am not referring to all Sony fans but one can't deny that there is a rather large camp who are cancerous and I will no longer resort to the cop out of every platform has its assholes and fanboys because Microsoft has their share and Nintendo has their share but I want to address the delusional mentality carried by these Sony fanboys like Silver Sky Pony. And this is this massive black and white problem they seem to have. The double standard is and goes like this. Anything Sony does, praise it. Anything bad they do, defend it. Justify it or sweep it away. But anything Microsoft does, scrutinize it. And anything bad they do, Crucify them further? I look at these delusional ponies and honest to God, it's making me sick. Xbox fanboys are so chill because they play online all the time. So they know how to talk crap and take crap without letting it get too personal. There is only one answer. The Sony Defense Force, by far the most aggressive, the most obnoxious, and of course the most defensive because they're in denial and obsessed with the Xbox brand. Let's look at some evidence. Even in Japan, Sony fanboys are called cockroaches. They are scared. Xbox One can do way more than the PlayStation 4. Xbox One will not get hacked like PSN will. Xbox One is put on such a high standard with all kinds of innovations and advancements and other wonderful things while Sony can't afford anything. Xbox One lineup embarrasses the PlayStation 4s. Xbox One controller is actually an upgrade and this is not preference, this is facts. Sony lost 50 million customers last gen while Xbox gained 50 million. Sony as a company might not exist in 10 years. Look it up. Basically, Microsoft is about to own Sony and the fanboys like Silver Sky Pony since the end. So they are doing one last delusional parade before the whole ship goes down. What people like Silver Sky Pony and other ponies and Sony fanboys hold on to is this glimmer of light the PlayStation brand had in the past and look to rekindle that spark. See it's morons like this that make Sony's job easy cause clearly you have people like him who are satisfied with Sony's shit offerings and undelivered promises. Now if you don't know I own both consoles the Xbox One 
and the PlayStation 4. And the Xbox One is clearly the best overall between the two. David, I speak for myself and the very few who know you. Go get some help. But as you see, I'm not the only one. This man is obsessed with Xbox fans and Xbox YouTubers making videos about Xbox fans trying to garner some attention. But everyone just ignores him. He's a pony with no direction. And on top of that, he's a YouTube failure. The glitch community is where he hides out with other ponies and PlayStation 4 fanboys in their own little pony world. Trust me Xbox fans, stay away from Glitch. It is a 100% pony stable. I can't say anything bad about the Google Plus Glitch community cause it's very active and I enjoy debating with the guys and one bad apple doesn't spoil you the bunch. Now at the end of his video even though he knew he was embarrassed by yours truly, his pony instinct kicked in. And he still made it seem like PlayStation 4 was better than the Xbox One. I find that insane and unbelievable. This guy is truly in the state of ponyism with no return. He is definitely a joke in the PlayStation community. To me, it seems like he's an old man that needs to let go of video games and go find another hobby like fishing or bike riding or even bingo you know the things old guys do I must have really hit a nerve cause this guy is in disarray but this is what I do I crush PlayStation 4 fanboys and ponies and you Silver Sky Pony had to learn the hard way I know what you're saying my Xbox Legion why did I respond to this reject? Well, the answer is simple. Us as Xbox fans and fanboys are not pushovers by no means. And I know you're probably saying, Hey Cyclonus, why don't you get the whole intro media gaming group to end Silver Sky Pony's YouTube career? <laughs> Actually, the group stated that he wasn't worth anyone's time and that it would be a waste. So chalk this up Silver Sky Pony as another loss and another win for me and the Xbox community. So let this be a lesson learned David and stop looking for fights with Xbox YouTubers cause you might get another ass whipping like this. So people it will be the first and the last time I address this moron. I am Cyclonus and my opinion counts. Get this through your head, you Jew motherfucker, you! You only exist out here because of me! Your fucking warrant don't ever go over my fucking head again, you motherfucker, you!